Close your eyes and imagine looking up at the night sky and seeing a faint reddish star shining back at you. You may not know it, but that star is the home to the closest exoplanet to our own. And it's a world that could potentially harbor life as we know it. This is Proxima Centauri b, the closest exoplanet to home. Earth's twin, as suggested by data. How would life adapt to such a world? Located 4.2 light years away from Earth, the Alpha Centauri system, a triple star system, is home to Proxima Centauri, a tiny red dwarf star. It orbits around a pair of sun-like stars, Alpha Centauri A and B. And right there, nestled in the habitable zone of its star, is Proxima Centauri B, the gem of this star system. Proxima B orbits its star at a distance of just 4.6 million miles. This is incredibly close, just 5% of the distance between the Earth and the Sun, and even closer than the distance between Mercury and the Sun. However, since Proxima Centauri is only one-tenth of the size of our Sun, the star's habitable zone is much closer to it. But the Goldilocks zone being so close to the star's surface also has its drawbacks. Due to the planet's close proximity to its star, it becomes tidally locked. One side of the planet is always facing the star, a scorching desert, while the other side is forever dark, exposed to the cold vacuum of space. This could make it difficult for life to find a foothold. Such temperature extremes on Proxima Centauri b make it hard for life to exist. But there may be hope. In the twilight zone, where the light and dark sides meet, the temperature is just right, making it a potential haven for life between scorched earth and eternal winter. It is in these conditions that life may be able to adapt and thrive. Astronomers discovered Proxima b in 2016 using the radial velocity method. They detected a tiny star wobbling slightly in a small circle. This subtle movement was caused by the gravitational pull of a nearby planet, and upon closer investigation, they identified the planet as Proxima Centauri b. After careful study and analysis of the exoplanet, it became clear that Proxima b, as it was named, was strikingly similar to Earth. In fact, the planet scored an impressive 0.87 ESI, which is a measure of its similarity to Earth. This score takes into account various factors, such as the planet's size, mass, temperature, and density. Based on these factors, scientists estimate that Proxima Centauri b is 87% Earth-like, making it a promising candidate for extraterrestrial life. But despite its high ESI score, much about the planet remains unknown, including whether or not it has an atmosphere. The star it orbits, Proxima Centauri, is a highly active red dwarf flare star, which means that the planet is constantly bombarded with intense stellar wind pressures, over 2,000 times greater than what Earth experiences from the solar wind. These conditions raise the possibility that the planet's atmosphere could have been stripped away over time, leaving it barren, exposed to the harsh conditions of space, and inhospitable to life. On Proxima b, where the threat of solar flares and intense winds could be a daily occurrence, life may have found a way to survive by taking refuge in the depths of its oceans. On Earth, we've already discovered life that can withstand intense radiation by utilizing specialized adaptations. 
coral polyps have evolved to produce fluorescent proteins that block excessive sunlight, effectively neutralizing the detrimental effects of ultraviolet light. In shallow waters, they can glow brilliant pink and purple at night, creating a stunning spectacle. Models show that it's possible with the right conditions that Proxima b could actually withstand such levels of radiation. A robust and strong magnetosphere could potentially redirect the stellar winds to the planet's poles, creating spectacular auroras that would be many times greater in size and luminosity than those experienced on Earth. If this holds true, it's possible that life on Proxima b could resemble life here on Earth in unexpected ways. Its surface would likely be much warmer than Earth's average temperature, creating conditions that could support life. Scientists suspect that any life forms on the planet would likely resemble those found here on Earth, as the principles of evolution are considered a universal law of nature, just like gravity. Evolutionary convergence is a process by which unrelated species can evolve similar adaptations to similar environmental challenges, meaning that life on other planets might look surprisingly familiar to us. The evolution of life on any planet is a delicate balance between beneficial and harmful changes. Even on Earth, where life has flourished for billions of years, the vast majority of species that ever existed have gone extinct. However, some life forms have managed to persist and thrive, and some have even evolved into incredibly complex organisms. Flight is a great example of this. In an environment filled with fluid-like water, one can either float if they're lighter than the fluid, or use wings to fly aerodynamically and generate lift. For example, the wings of bats, birds, and insects all serve the same purpose, but they've evolved independently of each other. Similarly, if two exoplanets have identical conditions such as temperature, atmospheric pressure, and access to water, it's possible that life could arise on both planets and evolve in similar ways to adapt to their environments. So if Proxima b supports life, and there's a high chance, at least to some degree, that it may resemble life on Earth. Additionally, the presence of similar conditions on exoplanets could also lead to the development of similar biochemistry. For example, life on Earth is based on carbon, and it's possible that life on exoplanets could also be based on carbon if the conditions on those planets are like those on Earth. But most carbon-based life forms, like those on Earth, have their own set of limitations. Carbon compounds have lower melting and boiling points, which can make it difficult for organisms to survive in extreme environments, like the scorching heat near a star or the freezing cold of deep space. 